Hi and welcome to another tutorial video for Vengeance Producer Suite Avenger. This time I would like to show you the FFT filter, uh, which you can see here in the middle display. Uh, it has three modes. The first is free, harmonic and bin. Uh, let's start with the free mode and uh, sawtooth waveform, uh, which sounds like an ordinary saw, but if we start to draw here, I can eliminate or boost frequencies in the sawtooth. And um, if I want, I can sweep these frequencies with the sweep dial. I can flip. So everything is upside down. And when I press here, I can reset it. Um, but much more interesting is the harmonic mode. In this mode, you see these bands here, which um, represent the harmonics and the disharmonic content in this sawtooth wave. By the way, it works with every other wave. I've just uh, chosen a sawtooth wave now because it's much more easier to understand. And let's eliminate everything so you won't hear anything anymore. We can now add the harmonic spectrum bands here, beginning with the, the source harmonic uh, sine wave. The next band would be the first octave harmonic. The next band would be the quint above this octave. The next band is uh, the next octave. This band is um, the next octave. The, sorry, the next quint. Next octave. Quint. Octave. And so on. So you are still playing a sawtooth, but you only have the um, harmonic content left. What is eliminated here now is the disharmonic content, which represented by which is represented by the dark bars. This is everything which lies between these two clean harmonics. I always call it the trash bands. This is where the disharmonic content is. If I raise them up too, you will begin to hear that is in sawtooth again. I can also eliminate all the clean content. can randomize and always it's possible to sweep through the bands. So what can you do here? You can build your harmonic spectrum from scratch like organ registers and like I showed in the last video you all the time, you still have the possibility to add FM modulation or these other uh, uh, dials here. And noise, of course. So yeah, this is, this has uh, endless possibilities. You can really 
use any of our factory waves and add, uh, edit their harmonic content. What you also can do is, let me reset it, um, we have the this feature here calling um, the V speed and the V strength, which let every band pulsate in a unique speed. Let me show this. So what now happens is that every band has its own pulsating speed, which is random, and we have a never ending modulation in sound. And choose the sawtooth because it's easier to hear. The speed can be adjusted here. Or the intensity can be adjusted here. Okay, but there's more going on here. Um, you also have a 90 degree low pass and high pass filter. This is the steepest filter you can have. Same goes for the for the high pass. And the slope defines the steepness. I would think this sounds like 12 or 24 dB, like a regular filter. But if slope is set to zero, it's really, really steep. Of course, this can be modulated. For example, let's take uh, the mod envelope here and drag and drop it onto the low pass filter. So now I've created a modulation. You see, it can be really fast. Okay, um, let me remove the modulation here. Okay. Uh, the last mode is the bin mode, which is pretty much similar to the to the harmonic mode, but you really see all 256 bands which the signal has been split into. Um, the bright bands here are the harmonic octaves and everything between is the disharmonic content. So what you can edit here is basically the disharmonic content better than in the harmonic mode. You see this now consists of almost only disharmonic sine waves. Sounds quite metallic. Of course you can also sweep here. Flip it. Or use something like FM. further process it. Of course, every time you also have access to our super source simulation. And this uh, dial, for example, can be automated too. We are the mod envelope. which sounds really unique. Random. And with V-strength and V-speed applied.
Okay, before I forget, um, the FFT also ha comes with a lot of presets here. So let's reset it. Let's do. Let's step uh, through some of the presets. modulation here. Several organs. See if you raise the disharmonic content and lower the harmonic content in a sawtooth, you will end up with a, with a square. Quite interesting. Okay, but I think that's enough for now. Um, I will show you more in the next video. I think um, that's all for the moment for the FFT section. So far, have fun and thank you for watching. Bye.